All right guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we get to start working on the Toyota Sienna once again. This time, we got a call from the dealership. So the door has come in, the fender has come in, the bumper, so we got a lot of parts that came in and then we could probably jam out or get this thing on the frame machine. Also, we got new wheels and tires. So this thing is not gonna be rocking these uh, Acura RSX wheels and a Ford Mustang wheel. We're gonna put some nice 20s on it, some originals. It's gonna look good just to clean it up a little bit. Well, let's go ahead and uh, hit the road, go to the dealership, pick up our parts, and get back to work. All right, so we're back from the dealer. Also, we stopped by and picked up some paint. So we got the fender, and what we have to do is jam this out and check out this door, make sure it's got no damage, but we're gonna check it out. We're gonna sand them down, scuff them down, and we're gonna paint inside and out and see how it is so we can put it on the car and we'll do a nice blend. But the fender definitely needs to be jammed out, so if you, once it's installed, it's gonna be good to go. Let's go ahead and scuff this up and get it ready for paint. All right, just like that, we got everything ready. It, it is wiped down, tack cloth, ready to start spraying the green. And uh, let's get it done. Let's get this thing jammed out inside and out, put some clear, and uh, we'll be ready. Let's get to it.
All right, so just like that, we got the new wheels. We got some new tires on them. So these kind of came off a of Highlander. They're 20s, definitely better than the stock ones with new tires, but you can see now more that this wheel is caved in, so we definitely need to strut on this side. All right, since so we got some time before we put on the frame machine, I might as well knock out some body work. So we got this dent we gotta worry about. This door is gonna be completely replaced. This door we're just gonna blend on, not a big deal. So a little bit of body work right there. And we have a dent on this back door. You kind of see it, not too bad, but we'll get that fixed up. We'll do a nice little blend on this whole side, make it all match. So let's go ahead and knock out the bodywork and then hopefully put on the frame machine. All right, just like that, it's the next day. The Sienna is on the frame machine. The oil cooler or some transmission cooler came in. So we can pull all this out. Should be pretty easy. Get that installed and we'll be done with the frame. And hopefully we can maybe install the door. Let's try it. All right, so just like that, we got the Sienna off the frame machine. We got inside the shop, so the next thing we wanna do, because it pulled out really nice, everything's lining up good. The oil cooler actually needs a bracket, so I ordered that today. But we got the door, it's dried, so let's hang up the door and see how the gaps look. So let's take this door off and get the new one on there.
just like that, we got the door on, and the gaps are looking really good. We got the fender, the gaps are looking good, the hood's looking good, the headlights still gonna come in, but unfortunately that's all the time we got for this episode. Next step is gonna be sanding all this down because the color does not match. Which, you know, I was thinking maybe it will, maybe it won't, but uh, we're gonna have to go to back to the paint store and get another color. You know, maybe give them the old piece so they actually match it up a little bit better. But we're gonna blend anyways, but there's gonna be a lot of sanding for the next episode. You guys, leave us a comment down below what you guys think of the progress so far. We knocked out the framework, we knocked out the bodywork. Yeah, we brought body work and we pre-painted every part. So we're almost there and uh, ready to go. So leave us a comment down below and we'll catch you guys next time.